Hello my friends, welcome to another short tutorial about Luban 3D and how to install it at the first time. Hello, you go to luban3d.com. I prefer to download from Google Drive. Then you see some readme files in different languages. Um, you have to choose the version of your operation system. Mac iOS. I work with Windows 11, so I take the Windows 64 folder and you see Luban X setup or exit text and setup MSI. If you install uh, Luban at the first time, use the setup MSI because it installs all the language packages you uh, need if you um, don't want to use the English version, version of uh, Luban 3D. Um, you install it, and at most time, uh, your antivirus program says, um, gives you a warning about Luban 3D. You have to tell your antivirus program to ignore that and uh, allow the the access for Luban 3D in the in the future. Uh, else, it deletes Luban Exa, and you have to re-download it again. In the beginning, then you have all the language folders. You, then you can choose into Luban what language you want to use. Uh, the MU license that it's important later. And Luban Exa. If you start at the first time, take right click and start as administrator. And you see it creates the MU settings file. This stores all your settings uh, if, if you use Luban a uh, different mode of, the, of this if you start it next time then you can go to uh, create little fun flat uh, a cylinder sphere whatever and it starts with your last settings from the last project that was number one tip number two if you're on the Luban website and the uh, on the photos on uh, Google Drive, go to the documentation folder, choose your language, and download the Hello Luban PDF file. It's the handbook of Luban 3D with a ton of tips and tricks, and uh, it helps so much for beginners. Uh, also, you can go to Google, uh, Google, sorry, to YouTube, uh, search for Lumen 3D. There are a lot of tutorials from uh, users, and you also can take a look at Lucian's uh, YouTube channel from Lumen 3D. Uh, where he show you the last updates, uh, the last features, new new features from Luban 3D, and it's very helpful. Number three, what's the difference between the free version, a free trial, and a license version? If you download Luban 3D at first time, you can use all things to experiment, to play with. Uh, there's no limitation in using this you can go uh, and create um, let's take this cookie cutter it's a simple cookie cutter so, um, or choose uh, another shape the only limitation in the pure naked free version is the export file size you can raise them from 10 megabyte to 20 megabyte. This means I can't save this model because it's uh, not a half megabyte. You can create, let's take little fun. Let's browse, take an image. Uh, now you can see in this uh, model size, I get 35 MB and I can't save the model in the P 
pure free version. But I can reduce this file, uh, the size and this reduced file size. Uh, and so you can export this small little fan too. What kind of license you actually use, you find in help about, and then you can see uh, when your license is activated, is it uh, non unlicensed or is it a uh, time limited uh, license? You can find it here. So let's go to lumen.com. Oh, sorry, wrong. This, if you want to use Luman 30 days for free completely without export limitations. Go to the license, tap and follow all these steps. You get full access for 30 days. You only have to follow the steps in um, on the site and you have to wait to get an email from Lujan and follow the steps in there. It's important if you refresh or if you got a new license for Lumen 3D, you have to go to Google Drive uh, or if you, okay, let's do this better. If you got a new license, you have to download the, sorry, license file and you have to replace the old license file. In this old license file, uh, your new license isn't Note, noted if you download the new license file and replace it and start Luan again, then you see your license in help about your new, then you see your new license or new expir uh, expiration date. If not, then contact Lujan and he helps you within 24 hours. Mm. If Luban uh, brings new updates, okay, uh, then it's important to download the. Oh, I, <laughs> I clicked the wrong tab. Then it's important to download uh, Luban Exa again and replace the old Luban Exa. You don't have to start a setup MSI again. It's enough to right click. Uh, Download the new Luban Exa file uh, and replace the old Luban Exa file. Um, I collect old uh, Luban files. Uh, I rename them and put them in a separate folder. Uh, so if a new version have a bug or doesn't work, then I can use the old file. But if there are any problems with the Luban Lujan, uh, Fix this very short. Yeah, that's was tip number three. Oh, there's one thing I want to tell you. Uh, if the 30 days runs out, then there is uh, nothing happens, and you uh, you can use Luban the the free naked uh, version so far, but there is no abonnement. I don't know what's the English word for. Uh, you don't have to pay anything. Uh, it's the same if you if you uh, want to try Luban for one month license or or for for a year. Uh, if your ex during time ends, then then you don't have to have to to pay more, more money if you don't like it. And one of the best thing is if you refresh a license, the money you paid before uh, counts on 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 your on, on on all your payments you did. And if you reach in uh, to, uh, at the moment uh, the permanent full time, uh, lifetime license uh, have a cost of four hundred US dollar. Uh, if you if you reach this value, then you you have a lifetime license. In this case, if you start now and use uh, the one-year license and paid your eighty bucks, 
then you next year you don't use it and then the next four years you, you use it again uh, then you have five times five times paid the 80 bucks and you reach the 400 and you get a lifetime license uh, and this this is the cost uh, the, the, the cost you have, you have to pay in the future or the, if and, and maybe the 20 uh, 27 the, the price for a permanent license uh, raised to 500 bucks you don't have to uh, to reach 500 bucks to get a full-time license you have to reach uh, the price from the first day you paid i hope you understand this little confusing talking for me <laughs>